Before he won 12 Grammy Awards, before he dazzled billions of fans around the world with his amazing talent as a performer, before he impacted on millions of lives with his ongoing humanitarian efforts, before all of that, he was one other thing. He was my brother. Hi. <laughs> I'm Jenna Jackson, and I'm pleased to be here tonight to honor the man I love and admire as an artist and a person, my brother, Michael Jackson. Grammy Legend Award is given for ongoing contributions and influence in the, in the recording field, but nowhere does it tell you what to do to become a legend. If I were to write a book of instructions using my brother as a guide, it would read something like this. How to become a legend. Let's start with the present and work our way backwards. Take a big chance with a live 90-minute primetime interview with Oprah Winfrey. Join me for the worldwide television event of the year. Put on a spectacular Super Bowl halftime show before the largest audience in TV history. Use your extraordinary popularity, influence, time, energy, money, and heart to help children heal the world. Create a two and a half hour standing room only concert event from Bucharest, Romania that gives HBO the highest audience rating in cable history. Release Dangerous and watch it enter the charts at number one and become the world's biggest selling album of 1992. Record Bad and watch it become the second largest selling album ever. Stun the Motown 25th anniversary audience with a legendary performance that leaves everyone moonstruck. Record Thriller and watch it become the number one largest selling album of all time. Bring your enormous talent to the creation of new style videos that are really mini movies with imaginative stories and mind blowing effects. Capture an armful of eight Grammys, the most ever won in a single year. Tour the world over, making new friends everywhere you go. Break all existing attendance records while visiting over 30 countries, many of them more than once. And bring the best in contemporary concert entertainment to over 10 million loving fans. And my joy, and my sorrow, and the promise of another tomorrow I'll never let you part from the always in my heart Create an international anthem with a superstar cast that becomes the top selling single of all time Make a serious effort to have four consecutive number one hits before graduating from grade school. It helps to have brothers who are very musical. And it doesn't hurt to have a little sister who loves you very much. But first and foremost, if you're going to be a true legend, try to be born with a lot of talent and the willingness to take the plunge. So to sum it up...
Now I'm very happy to present the Grammy Legend Award for 1993 to my big brother, Michael Jackson. Congratulations, Michael Jackson. <laughs> no, but I, I just wanted to say one thing, and seriously, I, I just wanted to tell you how proud I am of you, and how much you've inspired me, and how proud I am to be your sister, and how much I love you, I do. <laughs> Well, I love you too. Um, thank you. I hope this puts to rest, I hope this finally put to rest another rumor that has been in the press for too many years. Me and Janet really are two different people. <laughs> In the past month, I've gone from, where is he, to, here he is again. <laughs> but I must confess, it feels good to be thought of as a person, not as a personality. Because... <laughs> I don't read all the things written about me. I wasn't aware that the world thought I was so weird and bizarre. But when you grow up as I did in front of 100 million people since the age of five, you're automatically different. The last few weeks, I have been cleansing myself and it's been a rebirth for myself. It's like a cleansing spirit. I love you too. <laughs> My my childhood was completely taken away from me. There was no Christmas, there was no birthdays. It was not a normal childhood. No normal pleasures of childhood. Those were exchanged for hard work, struggle and pain. And eventual material and professional success. But as an awful price, I cannot recreate that part of my life. Nor would I change any part of my life. However, today, when I create my music, I feel like an instrument of nature. I wonder what delight nature must feel when we open our hearts and express our God-given talents. The sound of approval rolls across the universe and the whole world abounds in magic. Wonder fills our hearts for what we have glimpsed for an instant, the playfulness of life. And that's why I love children and learn so much from being around them. I realize that many of our world's problems today from the inner city crime to large-scale wars and terrorism and our overcrowded prisons are a result of the fact that children have had their childhood stolen from them. The magic, the wonder, the mystery, and the innocence of a child's heart are the seeds of creativity that will heal the world. I really believe that. What we, what we, <laughs> I love you too. What, what we need to learn, what we need to learn from children isn't childish. Being with them connects us to the deeper wisdom of life, which is ever present and only asked to be lived. They know the way to solutions that lie waiting to be recognized within our own hearts. Today I would like to thank all the children of the world 
including, including the sick and deprived, I am so sensitive to your pain. I also, I also want to thank all those who have helped me to channel my talent here on earth. From the beginning, my parents, all my brothers and sisters, especially Janet. <laughs> I am so proud of her, it's, it's incredible. I mean, I remember when we were little, I used to ask her to be Ginger Rogers while I was Fred Astaire. <laughs> <laughs> the Motown family, my teacher, Barry Gordy, Diana Ross, I love you. Suzanne DePaz, the wonderful, great Quincy Jones, Teddy Riley, my new godson, Michael Gibb, my new Sony family, Ico Morita, Mickey Schuhoff, Tommy Mottola, Dave Glu, Polly Anthony, thanks for making one of my most creative efforts. The album Danger is such an in incredible success. I love you all so much. Sandy Gallen, Jim Mori, all the fantastic fans around the world. I love you very much.